Hi mom, what's going on? I'm just out here walking the dogs. Walk good, right? Gotta have those dogs walking good. So, thumbnail says, I should say. Motard on a Grom? Man, you know. I was kind of thinking about it. What's all the hype about those bikes, you know? Um, they're pretty cool. I don't know, is it just an over glorified um, mini bike on the street? But, so I started thinking about it and um, they got some pretty cool mods for those bikes and stuff. And So yeah, it's pretty cool. Anyways, I was just kind of thinking, what are your guys' thoughts on it, you know? And I was also thinking, um, you know, my daughter's getting to be um, 16 here pretty soon, and uh, she's starting to learn how to ride. Hell, yeah, I may even get the wife on the bike, you know? And uh, so I have someone to start riding with, too. It'd be awesome to ride with the kids and stuff, so. But yeah, this was just kind of a quick video of um, your thoughts and I've seen a lot of videos on the Groms and stuff and I don't know, is it worth it or not? They're pretty cool little bikes and like I said, all the mods you can put on them and trick them out and bore them out and other things. Seemed like it'd be a pretty, uh, pretty cool project to do, so I don't know. But yeah, give me your thoughts, anybody that's ridden them or thinking about getting one and um, but yeah, I mean, I'd love to... Um, you know me, man. <laughs> Love the toys and seeing those pretty cool. And but I don't know. What? You guys want to go? You guys want to go? You know, into this cliff overhang. We'll go. I just gotta watch where you took a dump. Yeah, old Kingston took a dump over here somewhere. I'm also down here in this area looking at um, maybe doing some kind of uh, pit bike enduro track in here. Got some cool little sections right here. Nice little rock. Over here, another big ass rock right here. We've got the stream. I see potential in this, don't you? I don't know, what do you guys think? Old E-tard and uh, Bubsification. Oh, I said that right this time. Damn. All right, come on, let's go. Ah, sorry, bub. You all tangled. Kingston. Oh, there you are, bub. He like blends in so well to the surroundings. I wish I could take the, uh, the beagle off, but uh, you see he's nose to the ground and <laughs> he's gone. We didn't get him as a pup. He kind of moved into our house, got into our gated fence actually. And uh, that's some kind of vermin hole. Kingston, watch it buddy. You don't know what the hell's in there. Hey, come here. I hate leashes. You get tied around, especially walking through the woods, but Kingston, hey, come on. You don't know what the hell's in there. All right, come on, boy. So it's got a nice little rock garden section right here. That big ass rock. Nice little cave up there. It's pretty steep sections. Come on, boo. Old boy's not taking too well. Um, but yeah, give me your opinions on uh, what do you think and uh, about the Grom and, you know, should the Motard be jumping on a Grom or put his kids on a Grom or his wife? Um, and it won't be the first time on a bike, you know. I mean, kids will be practicing and everything else before <laughs> I shove them on a bike. So, well, a bike like that and nothing on the street. So, Motard's Backyard Playground. See, if you look at it, it's just kind of like a little tiny bowl in here. So I think it'd be really good for putting some kind of pit bike track, maybe riding the 230 back here a little bit too. Maybe do some four-wheeler stuff back here. I don't know. Options are always endless with me. But hell, I appreciate it. Ooh, this nice little section right here already kind of man-made built up here. Maybe a little hill climb up over that rock. 
come down around there and then maybe that's a little steep high maybe a little side section down here or something kind of maybe some switchbacks up and down the hills i don't know i kind of like that i look like kind of looking out of nature and kind of seeing the natural trails you know what i mean but look at this dog kingston man this dog's awesome doesn't need a leash stays right by you you know and that's what's good about getting a younger dog you know is being able to train him and like i said barney no 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 kingston come we ain't going up that hill i'm too old for that shit. we'll follow the stream down but if you wouldn't take off come on boo come on he's also getting over a uh something happened to his leg one night sleeping i think he caught his thigh or something so his front uh leg it's been doing better and that's why i thought maybe i'd get him out today to kind of loosen him up but he uh it's good to be out isn't it Oh, Kingston, man, he's just loving it. I come every time I want to try to give you a bath, you don't want water. But now you won't even get out of the water. Huh? Come on. All right, so anyways, um, yeah, so I'd like some comments and stuff. What do you guys think about um, Motard throwing a Grom into his assortment of vehicles, you know? So, and also, man, don't forget to check out my friends. Bubsification, Etard Adventures, uh, Dylan Hart, man, he's got that KX100, um, which I used to have, nice bike. Uh, let's see, what else, what else? Um, oh, making tracks over in Australia, and all my buds in Australia, hey, those goggles will be coming, Logan. So, <laughs> it's cold out here. Logan, so um, those should be getting to you, and the other stuff to uh, you, Daryl, uh, making tracks, be getting those to you too, and I appreciate everybody watching don't forget about the key tags and the stickers like uh etar said he's got some more stickers coming to me so watch for those and check out those guys stuff man they make stickers shirts he said so if anybody's interested i'll put a link down below where you can find them i can't finish yet what, what else do i got to say oh if you guys like what you're watching like i said i'm gonna be throwing some other stuff this coming weekend man we got a big weekend coming we're gonna be out the track yeah me and the Nedbridge boys, man. We're going to be ripping it up this weekend, so make sure you stay tuned for that. And um, make sure you guys hit your subscribes. Goggle giveaway, man. March Madness goggle giveaway. Fox and 100% pair of goggles to give away. So make sure you guys hit the subscribe. Don't comment on this video. Comment on the video link down below for that so I can get you guys entered. And also remember the 500 and the 1,000 giveaway. Tell your friends, man. I want to get that stuff out. Summer's coming, man. Get that gear out. I know somebody wants to be set up in that gear, so that's going to be awesome. Helmet, goggles, jersey, gloves, pants. I mean, the whole works. Uh, I should also have something else be coming this week, too, man. I cannot wait for this. This is really going to help out, I hope. Uh, my reps uh, wanted me to do a review on something, so I said, sure, send it to me, and let's get her on, man. So, um I think my dogs are a little anxious and they want to get on. So everybody be safe out there, man. I appreciate all the love and the support and people buying the key tags and the stickers. That means a lot, man. It goes out to these little doggies. You know, what, something scare you? <laughs> um, but man, it goes out to these doggies and it's going to help a great cause, you guys. Okay, so like I said, that's not what my channel's about, but... It's just, I'm just trying to give a little bit extra back for everybody giving a little bit to me. So, everybody be safe, you guys. And I hope everybody has a good weekend if I don't see you. And check out my page, subscribe, like, share it. Share the links, man. Share it all over the world if you want. I don't care. And everybody around the world, always be safe. And thanks for tuning in and walk good.